what's up guys so we have our sunroof here we're gonna go outside and uh see if we can toss that bad boy in it's only four screws nice fresh window ready to go in let's see what we can do what's up guys so today we're gonna be switching out the sunroof and let's let's see this now let's see if any glass falls out all right no glass falls out so the bolts are gonna be behind that. We have to get the sunroof into the vented position and see if we can reach those bolts. So let's try this. Okay, so that's up in the vented position. Let's snatch all of this, um, this tape and stuff off. So now that we got that all off the window, you have to um, you have to pretty much undo these. It's like a Velcro. And then you see the screws back there, one and two. This side, oh, and then you got a Velcro. I think it can go up a little bit more. I think it was getting held back by the uh, the sticker. We got all of these screws out on that side. And on this side, we got both screws out. So let's try to, um, let's try to lift it. Let me get my gloves and let's try to lift it. And it comes up just like that. So we'll sit this, um, matter of fact, we'll sit this in the grass or something for now. There it is, old sunroof is out. Let's see if we can pop that new one in. Matter of fact, I think we gotta go get a vacuum first and get all this excess glass out first before we do anything. So that's what I think I'm gonna do really quick. We're gonna go get all this glass out. First start after a few days. Cool, let's get everything in here and then we'll go to the car wash and get a vacuum again. Now let that warm up. It's really cold out here. I'm gonna check all the water and all that good stuff. So I'm glad I just happened to check the uh, the antifreeze is literally nothing in there. So we got some, we'll get that filled up real nice and uh, get that taken care of. And then we can also pull all this tape off. Let's try this again. thing has got like no pressure this car wash is like the weak car wash the pressure on this uh vacuum isn't like turned up really high so what i'm gonna do is i got most of the glass chips out and then i'm gonna put this new sunroof in and then go to the other car wash and then get it all cleaned up at the same time and hopefully we'll be able to get some more glass out of there back home let's see if we can mount this sunroof up and see if we can get it in there We can try to bolt it up now, get it all lined up. Let's see how good we can get it. We pretty much got it all all in however the window is not all the way up then we still have to do some adjusting so just the screws are in we have to loosen them and adjust it a little bit but we'll get it right we got it adjusted moment of truth let's see and there it is fresh new sunroof all good Okay, now that we got it all back in, we gotta put the curtain up like this side is over here. But however, you see that, you see it won't, it won't roll all the way back because we still got glass up there. 
So we're gonna keep that open. Try to get as much glass out of there as we can and see if that makes a difference. Then after that, we'll put these back on there. We gotta get this um, last little sticker stuff off the top of the roof and then we'll see how clean we can get this thing from the motor to the back. We'll see. Boom. So that looks a lot better. Got that on there. Gonna have to scrape this stuff off. And then we're gonna have to, um, I don't know if you can see it, but it's like glue. We're gonna have to go around the car and see if the best way to get all this glue and stuff off. Because if you can just hear it, it, it sounds rough. So we'll get that all taken care of today. We're gonna wash this thing down. See if we can knock some of this dirt off of here. So we got it all pressure washed down. We got the engine bay pressure wash. So now we're on our way to the other car wash to get the outside body clean. And we're gonna give it a nice detail of our own after it's all done. I'm not gonna worry about drying the car right now because I'm about to go get a real wash. That was just a pressure washer to wash the engine bay. First freeway test. Let's see how smooth she rides. Oh yeah, she's rolling. This thing is pretty smooth. Cruising at about right now let's try this out let's hope the new sunroof works out really nice we'll hope for the best in here this is a really good car wash a lot of people say that drive-through car washes aren't really good but i mean the paint in the body isn't the best anyway oh it works looks like it's holding otherwise we would have been soaked now for the lights where's the strobe lights baby there we go Yeah, there we go, strobe lights. Hopefully those uh, side mirrors are good because they don't have a cover on the back. So the wires are kind of exposed. So hopefully they're good going through this. If they're not, hey, what can we do? Now we got some red lights. That looks really cool in here. Finally got the car washed again. Uh, we're about to go over it with some of that uh, Meguiar's quick spray detail and see how uh, well we can get this um, sticker stuff off. We got the inside taken care of, all vacuumed out. Sunroof is in. Still not going back though. Might have to take the whole thing apart. I don't know yet. Yeah, you guys see no more glass anywhere. Now it's time to get it really clean and detailed. So they have one of these little pressure guns. We just shot it up here. And just by doing that, we got a bunch more glass out that we couldn't get earlier. So we're gonna have to re-vacuum and try to do that process again from this side, see if we get it working a little bit better. It looks like uh, the sunroof is stuck because it's glass still on like this half. It's stuck coming back and the car is dead again. What am I gonna do? All right, as you guys see, I got it shined up. We got most of that uh, adhesive sticker stuff off. We just need to go over the top. You can still see it up there, but on like the sides, it's pretty much gone. The back is looking decent. And then on the sides over here, it's pretty much gone. So now the car is dead. I had the door open for a long time. Now I gotta figure out how I'm gonna get this thing started. Unfortunately, we had to pay for a jump, $55 for a jump. And just like that, guys, we are back in motion. Car started, we paid for the jump. Thanks a lot, man. So we finally got this thing back on the road. The uh, the sunroof still won't close. It's stuck by glass. So we're gonna go try to go to a window shop, see if we can get that figured out. And then we need to go get another battery because we can't be dying like that. So we got the car wash. We got a little bit of detail going on. We got the sunroof in, windshield in, rear window, tail lights.
and it looks a lot better guys it may not be the uh, sharpest car on the lot but for the price i got it for and how clean it is i really can't complain of course there's dents and stuff everywhere but the dents are like they don't bother me dude as many cars as i got from copart that were bad this has been the most decent one so i really can't complain we just gotta get that sunroof closed now back at the auto glass place you guys might remember my buddy i came had to get the sunroof put in right because i didn't clean out all of the glass on the rails and all the tracks and stuff so they got it back out for me and then they're gonna put it back in right Pretty much got all the glass out. We're gonna try to do this again. We're gonna try to mount this up again and see if it's gonna flow straight. Hopefully it does because I really need it to go right. And we really need to get this done before the rain comes. All right, so we got the roof just about mounted up. Gonna pop in those four screws and get that thing in there. You guys just seen, all I was trying to do was put the sunroof in and get it clean today. Started getting it clean at the car wash and the battery died. Paid $55 for a jump, then the sunroof wouldn't close. So I had to pay another $100 for them to get the sunroof to open and close properly. Man, what a day. So we got it all mounted up, ready to go. You see that thing is up there and it does work. So let's get out of here. Let's hop on the road, get some gas, get back to the house and see what else we need to do. And as you guys see, it works perfectly fine. Perfect. We're blinking like no miles. Let's try to make it to the gas station now, dude. And we got 91 going in there. Let's see. That makes her drive any any different. We got most of the glue that was off the trunk here. So it actually does look a lot better. We just have to get the glue from around the sunroof. $20 gave us 143 miles. So we should be good for a little while. So that's gonna be a wrap for today's video. You seen we went to the car wash. We got everything detailed up. We went to the uh, the little outdoor car wash with the pressure washer, got the engine bay pressure wash. We also threw the sunroof on the roof. However, I put it on there and forgot to, I guess, clean it out really, really good. I thought I cleaned it out, but apparently not as good as I'm supposed to. So it wasn't opening and closing right. So I had to go get that fixed. Then we went to the car wash. Our car died. I had to pay some money to come get a jump. Today was just a whole bunch of like extra stuff that didn't need to happen but you know how it goes everything doesn't go your way as you want it to so long story short we got everything taken care of so that's gonna be a wrap catch you on the next one don't forget to comment like and subscribe and be ready for that next update video where we will get that engine bay looking all armor all up and nice and shiny we'll see what else we can do to this car as for the dents we can do some paintless dent repair that's pretty much next on my list if i don't sell it before then somebody has already offered me seven grand for the car already just like it is so not saying i'm gonna take it but that's just an idea of where the car is at right now price wise however i'm gonna be looking for a little bit more until then i'll keep working on the car and uh see what we can get done thanks a lot guys peace